I'm hoping someone can help me out here. I have a question about the electric motor. Um, an induction run motor. All right. So first, let me draw. Here's a motor. That's common. This is the start. This is the run. Now, we're saying this is the motor and these are the terminals. We're going to give it a, um, let's see, a current relay. So, let me draw it like this. Line 2. And this one, I'm sort of copying it from the book, goes up here, and it winds in a coil. It's actually supposed to be a capacitor the here. This all right here would be the current relay in that box. My question is, what makes the amperage decrease in the motor after it gets start after it starts running? What makes the amperage decrease? So let me read from this here. <clears throat> As the speed of the motor increases, the amperage decreases at about 75 percent speed the amperage will be low enough to drop the contacts okay so what that means is the motor starts the motor starts and right at first there will be enough amperage to close this so the start will be in the circuit now when the speed of the motor is about 75 percent capacity 75 percent speed the amperage will go way down. Now that makes sense because it no longer needs, no longer needs that much torque. So as it decreases this will open up so now it's only running from common to run. So that's how it works but my question is, what makes the amperage decrease in the motor? Because when the amperage decrease, when the amperage decreases, that's what makes this thing drop out. So hopefully you know what I'm talking about. In a in a uh, current relay of a normal electric motor. What makes the amperage decrease in the motor that allows it to, to, to run in running mode, common to run? All right.